welcome to Meditation for Extremely Busy People with Sister Genty and Mike George. In a world that is changing faster than at any other time in history, how do we find stability and peace in our lives? With such an enormous variety of distractions constantly attracting our attention, how do we maintain our concentration and clarity? And in a world in which ideas are the currency of continuous improvement, how do we sustain our creative capacity? The answer to these questions lies in the ancient art of meditation. More and more people are now turning to some form of meditation as a way of relaxing, rediscovering inner peace and accessing their intuitive wisdom. During this series of presentations, Sister Genty and Mike George will take you to the heart of both the method and the process of meditation. Sister Genty is one of the most experienced and widely traveled teachers of meditation. She has been helping people for over 30 years to learn and integrate meditation into their lives. Mike George is a consultant and coach who has been introducing meditative methods of personal development in organizations around the world. With almost 20 years of research and practice, Mike helps people make meditation practical in busy Western lifestyles. In this first presentation, Mike begins by reminding us of both the relevance and the benefits of meditation. While Sister Genty explains the basic method of meditation and leads us into a meditative state in the first of several meditation commentaries. If it were possible to bring someone out of the late 19th century and show them life on planet Earth in the 1990s, you may at first think how exciting it would be for them. Imagine their awestruck expression as they take in the incredible technological progress. Imagine their amazement at the discovery of TV, computers, telephones, faxes, videos, all in one day. Imagine their delight at the range of entertainment available at the flick of a switch. Very quickly, however, I believe they would find the pace of living intolerably fast, like stepping into a speeded-up film, and quickly they would yearn to return to that slower, deeper, and simpler lifestyle of the late 19th century. During the past four decades alone, the pace of change has accelerated beyond the tolerance levels of student, housewife and professionals alike. The development of technology continues to transform the way we work, live and communicate with each other. Increasing levels of stress, relationship breakdown and human conflict are all fuel to the fire of an increasing sense of insecurity. Yearning to step back and return to a time when life was slower, deeper, and when we had more time for each other is not an uncommon desire. But of course we cannot escape the here and the now. We have to deal with a world which expects us to do more in less time and do it better than yesterday. The key word here is doing. Both at home and at work, not only is there more to do, but everything on our to-do list seems to be urgent. And it's the tyranny of the urgent and the addiction to action which are the hallmark of the workaholic or the action addict. The result is a life out of balance where well-being is constantly diminished by the pressure of time, personal fatigue and the demands of others. This is what kills our... Sample complete. Ready to continue?